Hey guys, so today I'm bringing you my everyday makeup routine. Um, this is just something I do if I have to work or I'm just running errands all day and I want something quick and easy. I already started by using my moisturizer, which is the Aveeno Positively Radiant Daily Moisturizer. And then I'm gonna go in with my Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation. I'm gonna take that on my, um, what is this, the complexion sponge? I'm not sure which brand. Um, it's the same as these brushes. Real Techniques, that's what it is. Had a little brain fart. I forgot to prime my face. All right, the next thing we're gonna do is take your concealer, which I am using the Born This Way Naturally Radiant Concealer. And then you just wanna put it in a nice little triangle right there. And what I like to do is put a little extra on so that I have some left over to blend on my eyelids. I feel like I always need more right here. I really want to invest in getting one of those um, color correcting things like the orange ones for your under eyes. If you guys have any good suggestions on that, leave it in the comments below. So the next thing we're going to do is take a big fluffy brush and this Wet n Wild um, Mega Glow Contouring Palette. And we're gonna take this white, well it's kind of a banana-y color powder. Love this stuff. And set that under eye. Take this Maybelline Master Fix Translucent Powder. This stuff is seriously so bomb. I love it. I'm just gonna dust it all over. It is really powdery, so but I mean, that's just, that's just a translucent powder. It's gonna be powdery. I feel like even the Laura Mercier one is really powdery, so why splurge on that when you can get a deal with Maybelline? I love this stuff. Next, 
Next, I'm gonna take this little Kabuki brush and my L'Oreal Glam Bronze. I hauled this in my last haul and I've been loving it. So good. So just take a little bit. And I'm just gonna dust this all around on the bottom there. Bottom of my face. Not really being too precise, just bronzing. Making our skin look a bronze mess. this. All right. And then we'll just go ahead and contour. I'm gonna take this Real Techniques. Um, it's like a slanted brush. And my Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette once more. And then we're just gonna carve out the cheekbones with that. I just like to take this and brush out like all the foundation, powder, everything that has built up from doing my makeup. And then we're gonna take this NYX eyebrow pencil in deep brown. Next, we're going to go in with blush because I almost forgot about that and highlight. So I'm going to take my Becca Jaclyn Hill collab and I'm going to take the shimmery blush color. I can't remember what it's called off the top of my head because they don't have name something, which is okay, but and I'm going to take the Real Techniques, this is just like a small dome shaped brush, I'm going to take Champagne Pop, and just go right on the cheek. We're gonna take this Real Techniques, it's a base shadow brush, but I use it for blending because it's really fluffy. And we're gonna take our contour color again, same one we used on our cheeks. And we're just gonna blend that in the crease just to give a little bit of definition to the look without going overboard. This is literally how I get ready in the morning for work. Got 
got my coffee next to me. We're gonna take my handy dandy lash curler and curl them bad boys. I'm gonna take the CoverGirl the Super Sizer waterproof. This is my favorite mascara of all time. It's so good. guys and this is the final look for work or school running errands whatever oh wait I forgot lips I'm gonna take the Clinique chubby stick intense and this is roomiest rose all right and this is the final look for the day gotta clean up that line And if you guys liked it, I hope you did. And like, comment, subscribe. Um, and yeah, I'll leave all of my Twitter, Instagram on the screen. And I hope you guys have a great day. And I'll see you next time. Bye.